this is not going to be a fancy video or anything. I'm in the middle of making a video about my new gaming setup, and I'm going to be sharing it with you pretty soon. But in the meantime, I just want to show how I got screwed on eBay by buying a PS3 controller. It turned out to be a fake one. I bought it from a seller from the United States, and it looked very real until I started scrutinizing it. I started reading the text on the back, and I noticed a typo. It says a system software update may be required. So I started digging into it and I actually happened to have another box from a legit controller. The bluish coloring of the box is a little bit different. And then there's this symbol that says Sony Computer Entertainment. The one on the right just looks a little different. Intricate designs like this are hard for pirates to copy. The way they cut the box is a little different too. And I noticed the bottom has some differences as well. But here's the main giveaway. When you press on the analog stick, the fake one makes a totally different sound. So let's try this. The one on the left is real and the one on the right is fake. The one on the right is just a lot more stiffer and makes a, a different sound altogether. Sony would not be this sloppy to have differences between its controllers. They would do everything the same way. So I'm going to end up sending this controller back, but I thought I'd share this with you just so you can keep an eye out. But now that the PS4 is out, it's probably too little too late. There's probably fake PS3 controllers everywhere. There's a lot of factories in China that are copying stuff from around the world and selling it. And they've gotten really good at replicating stuff, but they're not quite 100%. For controllers, I recommend you buy them in store from legitimate dealers and not off the internet. There's really no way I could have told that this was a fake just by looking at the pictures of it online. 